guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda Jewel, and if you are new here, hey, welcome, and don't forget to, <laughs> what? And don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy the content that you are watching. I have set the scene with my crystals for really no reason, but um, I like to have them here. I have rose essential oil that the aromatherapy just really puts me in a journaling mood. Which brings me to why we're here today. If you follow Margot Lee on TikTok or other social media platforms, you know that she created the idea of having a quarantine journal. And that idea is just genius. So without further ado, I have other videos on how to journal. So if you're interested in those, I will link them down below. Today I want to take you guys along with making a quarantine journal and encourage you guys to start one if you haven't already. Margot has really great prompts and TikToks on it. So check out her content 100% and all the credit goes to her. Straight up disclaimer. But I just really wanted to share with you guys doing it because we are living in such a historical time. We are in the middle of a pandemic and we're also in the middle of a civil rights movement. Like that is just so beautiful and crazy and shaping and transformative and if you know anything about journaling you can attest to the importance of documentation and being able to look back in time and also like create goals and manifestations for yourself so oh, i'm really excited so let's just let's just get started okay i'll introduce to you my quarantine journal as it is right now which this is the front of it and this is the back. I kind of was inspired to do like a little vision board on the cover of this. So I just cut up old magazines. Let me show you guys what I have so far. So this I thought would be an appropriate beginning of the quarantine journal. Then I wanted to, oh good, I have the date of when I started it. A picture of me, oh, and then an Easter day recap. Over here, I wrote about like what quarantine is, some of the effects of it, like things we're going through, how the grocery stores are, the hospitals, state, then just a regular journal entry. This was clippings of the newspaper about the coronavirus, April 11th, 2020. I really wanted to save some old cartoons because I don't know if you guys remember reading history books and seeing some of the cartoons that they had during that time. So I definitely liked including that. I'm a sucker for moons. Then some words I really liked. Things going on. Advice. What social distancing is. Why we're doing it. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Then I wrote down some of my blessings. I uh, wrote down like a regular journal entry. My name. This is a page full of what the semester looked like for me, dating back to advertising agencies in January, January, working in February, my Texas media and analytics, starting the social media. I was supposed to go to New York and that got canceled. I was supposed to have an internship with the Richards group. The tweet that kind of told all of us how we were not going to finish on campus for the rest of the semester, moving out of my apartment, group project, evergreen media represent so just really what happened this semester a page dedicated to gratitude ah, planning out my first podcast episode that is so awesome I'm, I'm just so happy that that's in here my goals for the podcast some planning some journal entries okay so we're back I'm going to add a lot of the pages that I have been putting off so I already have this cut out and I've had my grandpa save me the news so that I can cut it up I survived the coronavirus t-shirt like are you kidding yes June 3rd here we go we have the protests in downtown Dallas how about the headline, crowds peacefully leave downtown. What's up vibe people? I just got done cutting a lot and now I'm going to paste them in the journal with a glue stick. Oh, and in that moment, she thought about making a TikTok, so one second. Okay, doing good. So 
here's the finished page. Now we're gonna make a page of resources for Black Lives Matter. We're getting really serious. And I got out my colorful pens. I made my list of resources over here. For another page, I'm going to glue the back of an envelope. And inside the envelope are my note cards from when I had my presentation. Presentation for school, let me be clear. So I just pasted down this envelope and inside of it are all my cards from when I was trying to learn my presentation. Now I think it's time to show you what we've done so far. Chico, shut up! Shut up. Resources to educate yourself between movies, podcasts, and books. And then black owned businesses to support. And then these were some other clippings I took out about coronavirus. And ta da. The goal with this journal is just to keep a timestamp of things going on, especially all these historical events. I made sure to mention that we sent some astronauts into space. I hope this inspires you in some way. Thank you, Marga Lee, for inspiring me. And if you can't find pictures that you want to put in here, I have also put pictures on like a Google Doc and then I'll print them out and then cut them and put them in here. So yeah, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to follow me on TikTok at the Amanda Jewel, Instagram at the Amanda Jewel. Stream my podcast, Becoming an Influencer. It is available on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and then occasionally I will also upload the podcast episode to YouTube if you would just like to stream it here. Thanks so much for watching. I always have links in the description. Use this idea and run with it to document your quarantine experience. I hope all of you enjoyed and I will see you in the next video. Bye! The Aftermath.